Australopithecus would really have been sick of us debating how we're here, they're catching deer. We're catching viruses. Religion or astronomy, Deuteronomy, it all started with the Big Bang. Music and mythology, Einstein and astrology, it all started with the Big Bang. It all started with the Big Bang. Pareidolia is a psychological phenomenon of the brain in which we perceive vague and random stimuli to be significant. The Greek word para in this context means something wrong or an error, and eidolon from the diminutive eidos meaning image, form, or shape. What do you see in this picture of the hood of a car? Taken at this angle, the windshield washer fluid ejector can appear to resemble a face, even though we know it isn't. Is this clock really sad? How about this plateau on Mars? Check out this rooftop. And it doesn't have to be human faces either. People are hardwired to recognize other people and objects, as hypothesized by Carl Sagan. Even from an early age, humans are able to recognize their friends and differentiate them from one another with little difficulty. It is the same mechanism that causes the human mind to see images and things that aren't supposed to be images at all. Take a look at the smoke on the right of this image. But the plane brought me farther, I'm surrounded For those who are religiously inclined, pareidolia can lead to what some perceive to be fantastic miracles. This grilled cheese sandwich sold on eBay for thousands of dollars. But the question one must ask themselves is, are people really this gullible? And the answer, of course, is no. Pareidolia is such a powerful phenomenon, it can make you believe just about anything. Adios and bye. Pareidolia also plays a part in the Rorschach inkblot test, designed in 1921 by Swiss psychologist Hermann R No, not that guy. There we go. The tests are designed to gain insight into the way a person thinks based on what his mind perceives when seeing these intentionally vague images. Adios and bye. This picture was taken inside a burning building, but it sends an eerie chill up your spine every time you see it because of its impossible resemblance to a young woman. In the same vein, auditory pareidolia is the brain sensing speech or patterns in white noise or satanic lyrics in alleged backmasked rock songs. Your mind is capable of playing powerful tricks on you. Images in the clouds, faces everywhere, it's all a result of pareidolia. As a final summary, what do you think this is? Nope, it's just a strange Martian rock. Ah, pareidolia, you never let us down. So, the next time you're home alone with a shower running, and you think you see a shadow on the other side of the curtain, remember that it's probably not Jason Voorhees coming to kill you, and positively just a trick of the mind. Her body's been kissed by the sun. Unless it's not. <laughs>